Hey, what's up everyone? Are you a casual player struggling to cop a dub? Well, don't you worry, because here at No Sweat Insurance, we got your backs. Not only are we dedicated to your cause, but our employees are determined to deliver reliable assistance to accommodate all of your Fortnite needs, all at a small cost. By using our super legitimate methods and installing a simple add-on to your game, you'll win every match in the blink of an eye. Your enemies won't even know it hit them. Get all of these at a very reasonable price of your left nut. Or get our Super Deluxe Premium Edition that includes an extra add-on for both nuts. Still not convinced? Hear what our customers have to say. Oh yeah, I ordered the Super Deluxe Premium Edition. Now I may not be able to have children, but I can sure as hell get a win. It's like all of a sudden all my bullets find their target. Definitely no regrets. There you go. Go get yourself the Super Deluxe Pack now at youtube.com slash c slash cpt kung fu psn or click the first link in the description. Hurry up. Stock is limited and demand is high. Alright everybody, today I'm going to show you how to get a win. This may help you if you either just started playing, you're a middle-aged mother, or you suck at the game, or all of the above. Basically, the trick is to abandon all your life goals and dedicate 18 hours a day to practicing and creative, or you can create a new account and play against AI for 3 matches. I personally enjoy that option because it boosts my ego when I feel like I'm trash at the game. The final option is just uninstalling the game. I've done that about 236 times now and it feels like an absolute win every time I do it. Oh my goodness, I almost forgot. If you'd like to support me, use code CPTKUNGFUYT in the item shop. Do it now. So, you can't get a win in Fortnite. Okay, so I've said just about nothing useful yet if you're actually here to learn and get some tips. So I'm going to break down getting a win into three main elements of Fortnite. Building, shooting, and editing. And then I'll show you gameplay of what I do to get a win. If something I talk about doesn't apply to you, there are timestamps in the pinned comment below so you can skip ahead to a more useful topic. So let's start with building. Building is obviously a huge part of Fortnite and is needed to win. Getting shot at? Just build, lol. The thing I see the most about players that can't get a win is that when they build, they don't protect their backs. Here's an example against my friend. Easy. As you can see, he definitely needs to up his game. I mean, his back is completely exposed to me and I can get some easy shots in and get a clear advantage. Oh no, what do I do to fix it? Build behind you. If you notice that you're unable to ever retake or claim high ground on a player, that means that you mess up your builds a lot or the opponent is just that much better than you. I suggest practicing free building and doing 90s and creative for a few minutes a day. Trust me, it'll help. Next up is shooting. If you're not getting wins, that means you're dying. And if you're dying, that means you aren't dealing enough damage to opponents. Wow, crazy, right? This is either because your aim sucks or your weapon choice sucks. To get a win, there isn't a ton of reliable weapons, and the loadout you choose is crucial to how you may perform in that game. Generally, the most ideal loadout is an AR, a shotgun, shield, heals, and then you get a bonus slot for anything else like a sniper, SMG, or grenades. Here's what my ideal loadout looks like, but if you want to take things a step further, land at a location with mythics that give you mobility like Caddy Corner or Authority. Having either the Grappler or Shockwave Launcher in your inventory makes a huge difference. As far as aim goes, it's hit or miss really. <laughs> I have an aim training creative map code in the description if you think you need to improve on that. Finally, we'll move on to editing. Now, editing is what most sweaty players use, and while you may think it's difficult or only tryhards do it, having good edits is essential. The thing you should be best at is wall and ramp edits because being able to pull off a quick maneuver like that can get you out of a tough spot or enable you to land a dirty shot on a player. You can practice your edits at the same time you practice your builds and creative. Here are a few examples where editing has really made a difference in a fight for me. Being able to edit quickly will give you a window of opportunity in a fight. I'm so funny. Alright, so now let's hop into a match and get a win because you know me, the best Fortnite player in the game. Make sure to watch closely and to take notes. Okay, but seriously, if you're not going to stay for the gameplay, stay for the memes. It's worth your time. Trust me.
Yeah, we got a team weather station for sure. Yeah, that's the main reason it's so hard to get out of here alive. You get a guy? Or is it an AI? I, I, I bodied one. Yeah, there's a full team in there. I see him right here. Oh, shit. I didn't see this guy, dude. I can't hear any audio. Oh, shit. Two stayed teams. Back. He had the mythics. They had the mythics, dude. If you could take the. Try to get it and leave, yeah. You, you, you left the rockets behind you. Ah. It's open at the top. Ah. It's not covered. Oh, they're fighting they're each other. They're not gonna I like think. this. They're not gonna like this. Clutch plays, dude. I should fight that. Dude, there's wait. Some loot. This mythic's just chilling here. I'm gonna yoink them. No, they don't even hear us. They're fo so focused on each other. We might be able to get some free picks here, too. Got a guy. Knocked. Hello. Top. Oh, yo, there's a guy right here. I got him. Another guy rolling in from Risky? Or full team, full team rolling in from Risky. To full uh, team. I think he revived his teammate, yeah. They're healing right in front of me, dude. They're not even building. Yeah, I knocked that guy earlier. I no way, one. he just flashed like four times. Oh no, there's a team here in a bush. Yeah, I, I didn't tag them much. I oh. dropped the shockwave for you too, and he sees it. I headshot one, I headshot one. The guy on you is the only other guy. And I bought you shot, I got them both. I just sniped them both. Oh, I just oh, hit him one for guy's 70. One guy's much closer. Laser. Okay, that guy was not building at all. Oh, yo, launching in on Flying. me. I got high. You got a full team after you. You might want to drop down. They're gonna come after me though. So I'm just moving. Oh, I got height again. I made them both drop and then I got height. Coming up to you. Coming up to you. Attacked them. Oh, I just got headshot. No way. They're building over to me right now. I had I, I body shot one, knocked one. Nope, nope, nope. Let's go. I may have missed all my shots on him there, but good win. We were coming out of retail with nothing, like with absolutely yeah. nothing. A shockwave with no shots, no ammo. Went from nothing, nothing to something. If this video helped you, make sure to drop a like, and if you're feeling a little adventurous today, drop a comment too. But if you're looking for something more advanced, stay tuned for my video on how to win in Fortnite as a sweaty player. Thanks for making it to the end. If you'd like to see more content just like this, click on one of the videos that'll be on screen in just a few seconds. Later!